Welcome to the Lion Legal Channel. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, Big John Fury, Tyson's father, has expressed concern. He thinks Ngannou is going to break his arm or break his leg during this fight. I've heard Chazura say that he could choke Fury out. You think there's any chance that this thing goes off the rails? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think um, I think everyone's everyone's too respectful. Every so there were sad scenes at the press conference of uh, Tyson Fury versus in Ghana, where David Adelaide approached Fabio Wardley and had a fight with him. Even though this was a boxing match, David Adelaide can still be prosecuted. He can still be prosecuted for what happened. So. As you can see in the video, David Adelier pushes Fabio Wardley and then a chaos ensues and Fabio Wardley seems to have had a tiny cut afterwards. Now, because obviously this did not happen in a boxing ring in which you consent to uh, getting into a fight, basically because boxing is essentially licensed and controlled aggression this was simply a melee and a fight outside of the ring therefore uh, what occurred could actually be prosecuted now there are several different statutes under which it could be prosecuted such as assault abh gbh which are not the same thing so given the fact that fabio w wardley had a cut is much more likely that the charge of ABH will be applied. ABH is actual bodily harm for tiny cuts, abrasions, things of that sort, which Fabio Wardley seemed to have. Now, if it was a much more serious injury, that would be prosecuted under GBH, which is grievous bodily harm. So, uh, obviously, it's sad when these things happen, and it seems to be maybe a London thing. It's not the way that people should behave, especially in a sport as dangerous as boxing. But unfortunately, this is the way that this day and age kids seem to think is acceptable to act, which is not, which is absolutely not. And in fact, the Boxing Board of Control should actually get involved and issue a potential ban for behavior like this imagine if a boxer gets caught and then they're not able to fight they're not able to fight so that impacts the card impacts uh, uh, the fans being able to see something that they would like to see how would that affect the sport itself when you let this kind of nonsense go on i put the blame squarely on david adelaide uh, make sure to like comment and subscribe